I'm done in pieces, people look to cut a swore. I don't even know what I keep it together for. Can't take it anymore, I'm always checking my heartbeat on these concrete streets, so I split to bittersweet. She sits in the gutter with her head in her hands, and now she's crying to herself. She just doesn't understand, doesn't want another backhand because she's been bad. Maybe if she's good, her dad wouldn't be so mad. She's so sad. She's shivering alone in the night. She's got to hold her own, arms wrapped around her tight. Even though this kid, she's 15 years old, she's living on the street because there's nowhere else to go. Nowhere else to go. And he just lies on a blanket, lights a smoke in his squat. In hindsight, he's thinking of the life that he's lost. He didn't think that drugs would take over his life. Didn't think that paint on pot could make living such a fight. He didn't think his parents would kick him out of home. Now he'd give anything to go back. He feels so alone. Tonight, as he tries to forget all his mistakes, he just can't stop smoking pot and sniffing paint. And I'm lost. I'm drowning. My heart's pounding inside. The black dog's barking and there's nowhere to hide. No matter how hard I try to run through the rain, that storm ain't passing today. They're all sitting on the sidewalks, sleeping in the parks. The invisible people, everybody walks past, ignored by society. Nobody cares. They think it's your fault that you've chosen to be there.